Hello Sausage, this is Nana Beryl and today we're playing The Sims 2 with the new Viveka family. Yes, that's right, love. And we have Devoria Viveka and I think it might be her brother, Donnie. Yes, Donnie in the trans shirt. And oh my God, look, he's showing a little bit too much butt crack, isn't he, love? You need to pull your pants up. That's what you get from swinging by the refrigerator in your undies, love. Yes, that's right. Now here comes your landlord and he wants you to choose an apartment in the apartment complex. He says, what do you think this is, love? An Airbnb or something? So we're going to have to choose an apartment for you, sausage. Yes, we are. Shall we go and have a look in here? I think we will. Now this one's quite big, but it doesn't have a separate bedroom. It's just got the one bedroom. And you, some of you are gonna, gonna want to have some privacy, aren't you? Yes, you are. So what will we do, love? I think we'll take it anyway. We might just have to use a curtain to separate uh, the room, love, because it's a bit open plan. So we'll choose this one, I think, darling. Yes, there we go, love. Oh, and where are we, love? Now, where have you gone, darling? Oh, he's down here. Look at Donny. He's chatting up. Who's this? Oh, it's Kylie Minogue. Oh, my God, Kylie Minogue. Hello, darling. You're looking very padam, padam, aren't you, love? Yes, you are. Oh, and look, that butt crack is very R18, isn't it, love? Yes, I think we should maybe move on from here, dear. It's a little bit, oh, it's a little bit graphic, yes. Now, she's going up to check out the room, and there comes Elon Musk, I think. Is he going to leave them a computer? I think he is. And she needs to take, she needs to take a dump in the toilet. Yes, she's going to do a messy poo because she's lactose intolerant, yes. And now we're going to speed this up and do some shopping. Yes, we are. Oh, thank you, Kmart. Some amazing bang, bang bags. Oh, it sounds a bit like Space Invaders from the 1980s. For those of you old enough to remember Atari video games and fountain video games, oh, it does. It sounds very much like uh, like the sound effects from those early video games from Space Invaders, doesn't it? Love? Yes, it does. I was going to cover it with music, but I think it's a bit of a shame because it does sound like Space Invaders. I think we'll put a divider in here. I think the curtain might block them from walking in, love, yes. Oh, and now what else do we need, love? We need a sofa too, don't we, love? Yes, we do. Oh, thank you, that's amazing. Oh, well, oh, isn't it gorgeous? Yes, it is. Oh, thank you, Kmart and Walmart. Oh, my God, look at that, love. We need a bookshop. Now, what else do we need? I don't need a bookshop. I've got a bookshelf instead. I've got a telephone from JB Hi-Fi. Thank you, JB Hi-Fi. Yes, that's right, love. Oh, and what have we got here? We've got a... Oh, we've got a Dell computer, is it? No, it's not. It's an Apple Mac, apparently. Very nice. Thank you for the Apple Mac, Elon Musk. You're amazing. Yes, you are. And there goes Donnie walking up the stairs in his little trans tank top. Yes, he is in support of, of Pride Month, love. Yes, that's right. And, oh, what are you looking at, love? She's not happy with the bookshelf, are you? No, and she's not happy with the telephone either. You're not happy with a lot these days, are you, Devoria? No, you're not. And look at her little Juno Burt shirt. Someone's been shopping at Drag Queen merch, haven't you, love? And he says, get away from me, Nana Bell. You're invading my personal space. And he's not happy with the telephone either. It's not pink enough. Yes, no, it's not. I think you need to make a telephone call, love. Yes, you do, sausage. You need to go out, yes you do, you need to explore the town and have a bit of fun. So we're going to take Devoria with you, aren't you love, yes you are. Look at his little pink shoes, yes aren't they gorgeous, they're very nice, yes he got those somewhere, I don't know where he got them from, but they're very beautiful, aren't they love? Oh you're looking stunning, the two of you together, yes you are. And your little Juno Birch merch, aren't you love, yes you are. And your nice hair, I do like the multicoloured hair, love, very nice. I take my hat off to your hairdresser, darling. Yes, I do. So we're going to go somewhere, aren't we, dear? Yes, we are. All right, love, get your knickers on and get out that door, sausage. That's right, love. Get on your fluffy knitted panties and out you go. And today, oh, they have an Uber, don't they, love? Yes, they have an Uber. And who's driving your Uber today, love? Oh, it's Simon. Hello, Simon. How are you? He's a very good Uber driver, Simon. We've had him before, haven't we, love? Yes, we have. And now we're off. Yes, we are. Look at that, love. Yes, we're off to the Carnival Centre. Oh, gorgeous. Oh, and look, we're at the Carnival Centre. That was very quick, love. Thank you, Simon. You're amazing. And is that a picture of Brianka? Is it Brianka or Bianca? I forget the name, love. I'm getting old. Oh, look at Del Toro. Isn't she looking amazing in that Carnival picture? Yes, and have you seen my little pride, pride area here? Look at the little pride flag, a traditional pride flag um, painting on, on the little pathway there, love. 
he sits right at this, the special drag carnival. Isn't it gorgeous? Look at it, love. And then a barrel built all of this from scratch, except for uh, the outdoor carnival area. So where you've got the carousel and the, um, oh, what do you call it, love? I do forget. The Ferris wheel. So the Ferris wheel and the strength test machine and all that. That's not, not my doing, love. No, it's not. It's not my doings. Uh, that was made by someone else. But I made all the buildings here in my special custom carnival centre. He said, look, love. Oh, she's going to get a root beer, aren't you, love? And she says, no, Nana Vera, I'm going to get a diet Pepsi. You don't know anything. Go back to doing anything, love. Oh, and what are you doing, dear? Are you going inside here? Yes, you are. You're going to take a photograph, aren't you? Well, I think you need to go in there too, Devoria, and take a photograph with him. Yes, that's right. Take a photograph of you two together. So this is where you're going to get some flashing lights, love. Be careful if you've got epilepsy, darling. Don't want you having any seizures, dear. No, we don't. Look at that, love. Flashing lights, a bit like strobe lights, darling. Oh, and that's that's just outside the gift shop. Yes, it is. The rainbow gift shop. And what do I see there? Project Renee being advertised from The Sims. Yes, from EA Games, love. On the back side of the billboard. Oh, and he's looking at the photos. They're very nice, aren't they, love? Yes, they're very good. They look gorgeous. Yes, they do look amazing. Your little, little pride gear, love. Now, you're getting a root beer, and he says, No, Nana Beryl. Oh, and look, it's a Juno Birch Lounge Bar. Look at it, love. Isn't it amazing? Isn't it gorgeous? Yes, it is, with its little hearts on top. And, oh, is that Juno Birch? I think it is, love. She's going into the gift shop, isn't she, dear? Yes, she is. What are you doing here, Juno Birch? And she said, well, I've got cabin fever, so I had to come out because I've been sitting inside and eating rice pudding and decorating the fridge with glitter. So now she's come in here instead to buy some 1960s earrings, but they don't have any love. So she's going to have to settle for these modern things, aren't you, love? Yes, you are. But never mind, she's still going to look stunning, aren't you, dear? Yes, you will. Oh, look at that, love, and they're quite reasonably priced, aren't they? And she says, yes, they are, Nana Beryl, but they probably don't have any real earrings made from silver. They're probably just stainless steel. So hopefully I don't get a rash that spreads down my neck, that's right. So she's going over here to look at the picture of the carousel. She does like that very much. It's very nice, love, yes. It reminds her of a UFO, so she has a bit of a giggle. Yes, she does like her aliens, doesn't she, love? I think you should look at this over here, love, the little green alien on the shelf. Not over there, love, you're on the wrong side of the building, dear. You need to come over this side. After all, you're an alien drag queen, darling. Have a look, turn around, that's right, love. Now look at the alien on the bottom right, love. Look at it, isn't it amazing? I put that there, especially for you, dear. Yes, I did. Yes, that's right, darling. <laughs> Oh, now, where are you going, love? Are you going, where are you, where are you going, Sosa? Are you looking at the picture of RuPaul that's advertised on Symbols TV4 every Friday night, love? Yeah, that's right, darling. Oh, and now she's going to the Gothic Seamstress Shop that's owned by Licorice Black. Yes, it is, love. It's a Licorice Black shop, isn't it, darling? Yes, look at it. And they do alterations on their sewing machines. And you can also buy clothes here, love. Yes, so she's going to buy a 1960s Friday night get-up, aren't you, love? Yes, you are. Have we got a dress here that's very 60s? Yes, we do. Now try that on, sausage. Walk past the sewing machines over there, love. That's right. And go into the changing rooms and take off your non-binary panties, love, and put the dress on. Put your little 1960s polka dots on, darling. That's right. Oh, look at you. You look amazing. Yes, you do. Oh, isn't she stunning? Yes, she is. She's looking amazing as you walk down. Oh, she's gone into the bathroom. Oh, where are you, love? I can't see. Oh, look at you, love. You're looking amazing. Yes, you're looking stunning. You should keep that on, dear. I think that suits you better than your tracksuit, darling. You don't look very common now, do you, dear? You looked more common in your tracksuit. You look better like this, darling. But either way, you're still stunning, dear. Yes, you are. She's going to purchase that, which is a very good idea, love. Yes. Now, you should be assessing your store. Yes, your own, your own little land shop, love, before you go back to England, dear. That's right. What are you doing, love? Stop loitering. Now, meanwhile, meanwhile, yes, that's right. Oh, we're going to Licorice Hack's place, love, and they've returned from the restaurant where she took her cat out and they were peeing all over the floor, weren't they? The cats, they were peeing all over the place, love. Now, it's about time you got up, darling. Have you still got the pizza there from Lisa from Pizza Hut? Yes, you have. You still got the pizza there, love. Oh, my God, you need to eat the pizza from Pizza Hut before it goes off sausage. Yes, you do. Never mind tidying your bed, love. Come and have some of Lisa's pizza from Pizza Hut, darling. 
there she goes, having a bit of a midnight binge, aren't we, love? Yes, we are. Very nice, dear. Waste not, want not. That's right, sausage. And that's right, she picks up Mr. Exploding Fart Bottom. That's right, gives him a bit of a cuddle. That's right, love, because she does like her Mr. Exploding Fart Bottom. He's a lovely cat, isn't he, love? Yes, he is. Oh, oh now, who are you ringing, sausage? Oh, you're going somewhere, are you? Oh, and she's going to take Mr. Exploding Fart Bottom with her. But I don't think he wants to go out, Sausage, do you, Mr. Exploding Fart Bottom? And he says, no, Nanny Beryl, I want to stay home and play tiddlywinks with the squirrels that live under the sofa. Yes, but she would quite like to stay home too, really, as well, and decorate the refrigerator with magnetic stamps. Yes, she would. But they've decided to go out and, be, and stop being so antisocial. That's right, love, yes. So she's going out too, and she's got, who have you got for your driver, love? I think it's Simon again. Yes, I think it is. Is it Simon? I can't see it from here, love. I hope it's Simon. I hope it's a good driver, love. Yes, now we're going to the carnival centre as well, aren't we, licorice hat? Yes, we are. Oh, and look, they've arrived at the carnival centre. Yes, they have at the drag carnival, and you're looking rather glamorous in your black dress, aren't you, love? Now, be careful. Don't drag it along the ground too much, dear. You don't want to have to wash that again. We're running out of personal automatic. Yes, we are. And what are you doing looking after other people's animals, dear? You're too busy for that, love. We didn't come here to eat Tim Tams. No, we didn't. And what are you doing, love? Are you cleaning yourself in the middle of the road? Be careful. You don't want to bounce the moonlight off your bottom, love, and show everybody your wobbly parts, do you, dear? No, you don't. Now, where's your cat going? What are you doing, Mr. Exploding Fart Bottom? What are you doing, love? Oh, now let's have a look around here, love. Where's the cat gone? Where are you, dear? Where have you disappeared to? Oh, there he is. What are you doing, love? You're a wandering pussy. And he says, no, I'm not, Nana Beryl. I'm an adventurous pussy. I'm not a wandering pussy at all. I'm doing some investigations. What are you investigating, love? None of your business, Nana Beryl. Stop following me. I've got things to do. I'm doing something on behalf of Juno Birch, he says. Yes, he's going round the corner. What are you doing, love? None of your business, Nana Beryl. Go do your knitting, he says. Now he's walking down the rainbow pride footpath, yes he is. So Mr Exploding Fart Bottom is wandering into Juno Birch's special lounge bar to do an investigation, yes he is, on her behalf. He wants to assess the staff. It's a bit like undercover boss, except he's not the owner of the business, love. Yes, he's doing a bit of a spy on them, love, yes he is, he's spying on them to see how good they are at their jobs. Isn't that right, Mr Exploding Fart Bottom? Yes it is. And look at the lava lamps over here, love, aren't they nice? Whoever made those from Mod the Sims, very nice, love, very good. And he's meowing, he's saying, Oi, bitch, turn over the television, I'm missing House of the Dragon. Yes, I am. Yes, the sequel to Game of Thrones, House of the Dragon, season two started, and I'm missing it. Turn it over, please, thank you. Because the barman was watching the boys, yes, he was with Homelander, but now he's busy, yes, he's got to serve people, and oh, and she's found him, yes, she's been wandering around looking for her pussy, and now she's found it, love, she's found her special pussy, haven't you, darling, yes, is there you are, Mr. Exploding Fart Bottom, so she's going to pick him up and give him a bit of a hug and give him some love, aren't you, love, yes, but don't squeeze him too tight, love, because like I said, we're running out of laundry powder, and we don't want him to redecorate your dress, darling, yes, it's too expensive, Hmm, and look at the photograph in the background, isn't it nice, love? Isn't it a good photograph of Juno? Yes, it is. And oh, look, it's Dixie Cartel and Regina Regina. What are you doing here, you two? Oh my God, you've come as well. Yes, for Pride Month. What are you upset about, Sausage? Need to get inside and have a look. Yes, go and have a look at the gift shop, dear. And who's this coming out of there? And now we're inside Juno's lounge bar and Regina, Regina doesn't waste any time, do you, love? No, and she's putting unusual shaped things inside her mouth because that's unusual, isn't it, love? Yes, it is. Oh, and look at the decorative outside of the building. Isn't it nice, love? Don't you like that window? I do. And oh, look, it's the top of the gift shop and what do we have inside? Oh, we've got Dixie Cartel. And she's asking the store owner, she says, Hello, do you sell any eco-friendly tuck panties? And he says, no. She says, well, love, I'm going to have to buy something else then. So she does, dear. Yeah, she's going to buy some jewellery, I think, dear, aren't you, dear? Yes, don't quite like those. Then we'll choose a ring. Yes, we'll choose one of these rings over here. 
just be careful you don't wear it on the wrong finger, love, or they might think you're already taken. Yes, that's right, love. Let's have a look. Yes, we'll purchase that ring. It's very nice, isn't it? Yes, it is. So she's going to put that in a gift bag, and he says, would you like that gift wrapped? And she says, yes, love, I would. I would like it gift wrapped so I don't have to stick it in my leg warmers when I carry it out, love. Oh, and look, we've got... Oh, what do we have here? She's going into... Oh, no, she's going into the Juno Birch Lounge Bar, aren't you, love? Yes, you are. And what are you going to do, love? Are you going to stick things in your mouth too, darling? Oh, now, Dixie's having a drink. Now, don't get too drunk, love. You don't want too much of that. The last thing we want is for you to start eating your shoes and hiding the TV remote control in strange places. Yes, we don't want that, do we, love? No, we don't. Oh, my God, look at you, love. You look a bit doolally at the moment. Yes. Love, I think you need to stop drinking that, darling. Yes, oh, she's got a bit emotional, haven't you, love? Yes, I think she's gone a bit do lovely, darling. Yes, she wants to change into her 1960s get-up and feel the carpet. Oh, it's a bit strange, love. Oh, now she's doing push-ups. Yes, I think she's gone a bit do lovely, darling. Yes, I think she has. What are you doing, sausage? She's going to take a seat over here at the lounge bar, love, yes. Oh, and look at her, dear. I think she's being visited by the special rainbow fairies who have been whispering the secrets of the universal energy into her special non-binary earlobes. And I think it's about time that we ended the video for today because she looks at me like she's going to chop me up into little pieces. So I think we'll return next time. So for now, I think that's where we'll end our video for today, sausages. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.